I'm gonna take one of my coach's comms. Are you? Which comms? Up the toll road. Up? Where I, well, there's Let's only... up on the segment, can I beat Ed Laverack? We'll see, find out soon. Good luck. How are you, Edward Peter Laverack? I feel snoozy. You don't seem that confident? Well. Uh, oh, uh, oh, this is for main episode. <laughs> I wouldn't say that your specialist com hunting area and his specialist com hunting area are on a par. Beep. This is like one of the steepest sections of the climb. They're different areas. Yeah, <laughs> mine are fat comms and <laughs> his are lighter comms. Yeah, yeah. Something like that. He's got a 27 inch waist. Does he? My ankles are 27 inches. <laughs> Blood clot. <laughs> Still use that one. Nat's cleaning my glasses. Taking the hill climbing bike. Right, we've got the hill climbing bike. It's 100 grams lighter. We've got the zips on there. Uh, we've also got the flashy Garmin on the back and the saddlebag. Uh, I don't really know why that. No bottles for weight. Extra weight is taken off. And we've got the uh, GoPro on the front. Right, we found some blue sky. So, whoa, bumpy, bumpy. We're off to Porlock now, so up through Minehead, we're gonna take on Ed Laverack. <laughs> Everyone says that Ed Laverack's the best hill climber in the world, but like, I don't know, so I'm gonna see how good his comms actually are. I'm gonna try and take one. Some people are moaning. I did the comm tour last week. Some people are bloody moaning online, kicking off. Because I didn't include bottlings, so uh, they got a noise, so there you go. Just for the views, we can tag that now as Minehead bottlings. Let's go and look at some wind. For right, it's probably gonna be too windy to, um, we need it the other way, really, to have any chance of getting Ed Lavrax comm. We don't think it's gonna be much hope, but luckily we've got some nice weather. It was a bit wet earlier. Yeah, yeah, you can see here, no comming if, the, if it's that way, so behind it, Arthur. I think they are out for a 5K. Still do with a bit of a wash, couldn't it? Really, if I'm honest. It's Laura. Hi, Laura. You right? Laura. More cycle crossing. Cobbles. Any PBs? No PBs. There's a little kite flying. Hell of a beard on him. I would do a time lapse, but I haven't got bloody time. Is Uncle Martin. Bloody bomb pros, aren't they? Nice blue sky, but I'm riding towards the rain, I think. I'm this far away from putting in the plug and letting, letting Ed have it, to be honest. Woo! Right, I've stopped for a little break because I am tired. I mean, oh, my back is in bits. Fred's run was down there from this episode, up here. Uh, so yeah, there's, and that, that's where we went bike packing, up there. So I've stopped here just off the road, just to get my breath ready, going through Porlock, because I've, uh, now I've got so many bloody Patreons. Uh, the Patreons bought me this. So I've got a little road mic there, going along here, all the way up here to here. So I'll go and talk to you all the way up, up the toll road now. So that'll be interesting, <laughs> like a podcast on a bike. The wind's really weird, I can hear people talking, so this is my phone. On a serious note, thank you to the Patreons. We've got Peaky Blinder, PK Blinder. I don't know if I'm allowed to use your real name. Wait, Liam Wilson from the Comtor and uh, and Andrew Hull. Andrew Hull from where are Cotswolds? Getting overtaken. Flying. Oh, at the top. He <laughs> was just like, he came up and was like, how do you get in front of me? Bloody typical, uh, typical Cotswolds accent. It's coming down at some point as well. So that I want to do more of this. So, Patreon, link below if you can. Hello. Hi. Right, this is where Phil Lovett went for a pee one day, so uh, we'll get that sign written, get a little plaque up for him there. We're nearly there, it's a hell of a hill climb to get there. I'm not taking the full one off, off there, just this short one. So it's 0.25 of a mile, this many kilometers. It's probably like 0.23 actually. It's called Can I Beat Ed Laverack? So I don't know who made that one. 
Ed did it in 40 seconds. 360 something watts. Uh, uh, 21.5 average speed. Again, I don't know what that is in kilometers. But we'll see what we can do, guys. I'm not feeling confident. Um, because this, this headwind is bad. Right, it's come up on the segment. Can I beat Ed Laverack? We'll see, find out soon. I was calling Ed Laverack, not Casey Neistat. <laughs> right, it's Ed Laverack hacks. Yeah, I like my hack in the time zone, did you? Full aero, look, I've taped up my vents right for tomorrow's 50 miler. That's the Hexar aero helmet. Did you break the two hour mark? You have to find out in the video. Which one? That one? <laughs> Hexar, got to be happy with that, haven't they? Yeah, they're sending me new, uh, <laughs> new covers. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, I, I like it, I like it, customization. Is this a bloody advert? You've got Sun God and, and Band of Climbers on. Every time I call you, I have to put hashtag advert in front of it. Not every time, you dipstick. <laughs> People are wondering why I'm talking to myself in a car. You're a vlogger, you always talk to yourself. <laughs> sorry, you're a cyclist that vlogs. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Not, not in front of Sorry, sorry. <laughs> hey, coach, I've been out to try and get your com. Which com? Up the toll road. Up. Up the toll road. <laughs> well, I, well, there's only. It can't be, because unless you use that flat section, well, flat section that we tested. <laughs> Piss off, it's 3%. <laughs> <laughs> it's still 4% too much. <laughs> You're too bloody right. Unfortunately, the headwind was too much for me and I didn't get it. You didn't? No, I didn't get it. So if you got the other way, you might have got it then. I, I'm going to blame the coach. <laughs> but me and Bullet are starting a new backpedal training plan tomorrow, aren't we? Yeah, and a couple of others by the looks of it. Paul Borum. It's Paul Borum. Hi, hey. Paul. And Paul's dad, I assume. Yeah. Any, anyone else? We mentioned Bullet already. <laughs> yeah. Am I? You're number one. Oh, I, that bullet's number one. Now the hard work starts now. Training starts now, Bullet. <laughs> yeah, Bullet was first, obviously. He couldn't wait. Uh, he just had to remember his password. I'm in. <laughs> so yeah, sign up. Link below, sign up. Is there any discount codes going? That's 25, I heard. Okay, just if you're English, that was back, B-A-C-K, 25, okay? <laughs> He's got an English dad, but you wouldn't realise. <laughs> you're pain in the bum, you. <laughs> yeah. Right, coach, I'll see you tonight. Six-minute video tonight. Couple of weeks. Months. <laughs> <laughs> we might be uh, doing a little trip down your neck in the woods. What, cycling down? Oh, that's a good point, actually. <laughs> <laughs> I'll, I'll, meet you at, I'll meet you at Bristol and we'll cycle back. Oof. I'll still be a fair way for you. <laughs> Yeah, but it's all downhill from Bristol. Mm, true, yeah, true. Yeah, true, pick true. up a couple of comms on the way through. Yeah, what, you're sitting on you? Oh, should we... <laughs> should we go and do a couple of appearances in some cycle cafes in Bristol? Do some book signings? Yeah, we can meet up with Hank and... Uh... Who? Huh? Who? <laughs> <laughs> i got to drop off his DVD so we can do that. Hank! Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I think I've linked to too many bloody videos in this episode. <laughs> right, so when you're down then, we're going to have a proper comm off, aren't we? A comm off uh, or a versus. I mean, oh, yeah, versus. Not versus. What we could do is like fat sprinter versus professional cyclist. I'm not a fat sprinter. <laughs> and I'm not a professional cyclist. <laughs> Hill climber versus sprinter then. Comment below if you've got any ideas for challenges. W one I know is going to go down well is uh, how far we can jump over a cattle grid. <laughs> I'll build all down it. <laughs> <laughs> I've told you I'm going to beat you up Dunkery as well, aren't I? Well, that could be one. Like, can Five. I climb Dunkery faster than you can descend it? <laughs> you probably could, but you could. Five pints at the bottom and see who gets to the top first. <laughs> yeah, I'm definitely not even going to probably finish mine before you finish yours you. and get to the top. <laughs> I'll, I'll finish yours off on the lap when I come past you. All right, Edward. Uh, Edward Peter Laverack. Yeah, you got it written all over your house. <laughs> yeah, yeah. No, I've rubbed it off now. I used your, I used your special rubber eraser. You went all, you went all Ed mode on the, uh... Available from Backpedal website soon. <laughs> <laughs> Cheers, coach. Bye. Right, I know why I didn't bloody do it. Didn't have me Ed Laverack socks on, so... God, I brought them all the way.